was one lucky little frog. Oh. Oh. One lucky little frog. Tidy, 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 tidy. It's plain dead, look. Nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with the little frog. It's just plain dead. Are you alright? I'm going to pop him somewhere. Very safe. Come on. <laughs> Well, this is my new, what I call, Dalek. My new Dalek composter. Free from the council. So, this is up the top of the garden. I've already got cardboard in it. Wood. Paper. Brown stuff. Lavender. Stuff from the guinea pig's place. And now... Oh, some grass on the top. So we now no longer have bins, guys. They've been taken away and we've only got a card we can use and uh, machines dotted about the place. But with the card, we did indeed get my wee Dalek and a little compost bin for the kitchen. This goes to washing, but that's what we've still to do. All around here. And that's this side done. Midges are everywhere, absolutely everywhere. <laughs> Having a little breather, let's see what Mr. H is up to. Right. Oh, that's pure normal. He's got to do everything himself. So that's to come down. What are you up to, Mr. H? The top of the tree. My goodness me. What length is that ladder? Right. My herring or stock or whatever you call it. Oh. That's going to get moved before it gets demolished, I think. But so far, this is what the other half is doing. And round to you, that's what's come off. <laughs> busy, 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 busy times. And I know this has to be cut back. Don't know if he's burning it. Save him some. There you go, just to show you. Look at the height of that tree. No, two trees. That one here is bald it. So that's just to get cut down, but it's an awful lot thicker than what it looks. A bon courage, Mr. H. Bon courage. Right. This is what he's dug out. And this, believe it or not, is not a healthy tree. It would not be getting taken down if it were. Look at all the holes of a little woodpecker. And having a munch. And usually we get all the mushrooms out here. Oh, you can see it there. It's all crumbling at the bottom. Look at all these elephant legs. Looks like big elephant legs. Right, I'm out the way. Off we pop. Let's carry on as we were. What are you saying, Mr. H? You alright? You alright, Mr. H? Clean your eyes, my goodness me. This guy, Sky. This guy's guy. What's she up there? There's she dear. That old little sky guy. What are you doing, my little chi chi? Right, onwards and upwards before we get a break. Right, so there we have it. Everybody. Next job up will not be tonight as it's uh, half past six. So I'll be cutting back all my raspberries, cutting all the calendula right back to the bottom, and they all live and sprout and grow more flowers. Over the winter, Cosmos, 
I've saved hundreds of seeds, so just drop them in the ground. And we do have an Italian fig. I've had a couple of them, which are actually the green variety. And purple inside, very, very, very nice they are too. Uh, Daniel's little apple tree that we planted a few months ago it was coming on leaps and bounds. Leaves are falling back now, right enough. Another calendula in there, another apple tree in there, and the peach tree that I thought I was dying off. It's actually come back to life. I've lost one and now we've got another one. Right. I don't think we're going to get any more cucumbers off of that. So all the raspberries will need to get put, cut back, as I said, and I'll do that tomorrow. And other job, a bit of weeding and trimming along the sides, and I'll zoom in a wee bit. Get my lavender all trimmed. All that gets cut off. Make my oils, but I've made my oils this year, so these here smells amazing. These here will go into making little lavender bags, I think. Still trying to put new flowers out, but a bit late in the day. So anyway, that will get cut back and trimmed to a nice bush tomorrow. My Gora, wedding day Gora is looking beautiful. All these things have all died off a few weeks ago with the intense heat. And now with the cooler weather, they're all popping back out again. I've got them trimmed, washing's in, fed the cats. All I'm going to do now is brush up, get rid of the grass, and have a little sit down. There we go, that's where we're at now. That's quite a good job done, out of the way. Catch you on the next one, guys. New help, Mr H. He's on the way up the ladder. All the way up there. Think about that, right? Yep. 